Hello Gemini and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. They're really strong energy off of your ex, okay? Uh, they've been in a toxic situation here um, with, with a karmic and the karmic keeps blocking them from, from leaving or moving. What is, they keep getting reeled back in. This karmic just refuses to let this person go. If they try to make it towards the door here, this is a door in the background. She stops them. She stands in the middle, okay? She physically stands in front of the door. They're currently trying to think of a creative way to get out of that situation, okay? Because nothing seems to be working. She keeps blocking them from leaving. Um, but I also have, and look, there's a little gnat on this picture, I also have you meeting somebody new. At least this is what your person is thinking. They may be finding this out. So maybe they're seeing some kind of news about you getting new love. Okay. But you've got people lined up for you to, I, I, I wonder if you even know this. I feel like it's behind the scenes. You may have a lot of masculine energies that want to be with you, want to date you. Okay. You may not even realize how many people um, want you so bad, all right? Because you're just, you're glowing out here. Look at that smile. You are protecting your heart, though, okay? I feel like you're going to be very cautious. But out of all of these options, there is one here um, who's, I feel like they're going to come in the right way, all right? Um, they're going to approach you correctly, so, yeah, this masculine knows it. I'm, I'm getting the sense that this is something that they've recently learned, okay? Um, that you could have somebody new already, and it's shocking to them. They're like, you've got to be kidding me, right? Look at the look on his face. No, <laughs> no, that's what he's saying. It instantly makes this person... They, it's like they want to hide. They try to, maybe they find this out through a friend or in a public place. They could even see you meeting or talking to someone else in public because they have to hide how they feel for a while until they get home. Okay, once they get into um, a place where they're, it's private and no one can see them, they completely have an emotional breakdown. This person breaks down over this. Okay, so, um, and I feel like there's a karmic individual that's watching them have a breakdown. Um, and she does nothing because she just wants to keep this person stuck. Okay, she really does. She's not letting go. And your masculine, or whoever this is, your ex, they feel like a complete clown. They feel so embarrassed, or maybe that's who they're um, seeing it as, who, whoever they're with, maybe that they see them as a clown. I don't know. But they are so sad. They're wrecked over this news. Okay? Um, or over whatever it is that they see. And I feel like they're seeing you talking to other people. Um, they could even see this, like, on social media. If you're posting any pictures of anyone, you know? Um, yeah, and this karmic has just done too much. She's getting tired, you guys. She is. Um, I, I feel like maybe she's done some spell work here, but she has done way too much. Yeah, yeah, I feel like you're meeting somebody new. This is the Two of Cups. You're meeting someone new, and, um... Your person is realizing this, and it's uh, it's breaking them down big time. A lot of tears. Yeah, I feel like you're in the public eye somehow. Maybe some kind of spiritual healer or teacher. You could be a teacher. You could be. You could teach. Like I don't know why I'm picking up on healthcare these days. You could teach something like. Um, safety classes or something like that you could have some kind of um spiritual platform or um yeah you're attracting the attention of a lot of people a lot of people and i i feel like i mean it's because you look so good i'm getting the two that some people are amazed at how you look 
you could be um, older, you know, but you're looking fabulous, okay? Yeah, somebody knows this situation is coming to an end with the karmic. This masculine is so distraught. They're literally, uh, they're in so much pain right now. I feel like you've got your spirit team over here in this karmic situation whooping their butts. Um, yeah, and they're under judgment too with the divine out here. Yes, this is my divine card. <laughs> Every time I, ha I see corn in a card, I think of the divine. My, my daughter actually... Um, says that, oh, that's heaven, right? And I, if there's any kind of binding spell work done on your person, um, that's being knocked back to whoever did the spell work. So I feel like this karmic is feeling the intensity of all of the bad energy that she sent out. Um, yeah, a lot of fighting going on in that situation. This masculine is miserable. People talking about you, grouping together. They're listening to um, them. I feel like they're trash talking you, I got to say. it's it's. It looks to me like three feminine energies getting together um, to trash talk you. But you're just out here doing your thing and meeting new people. Yeah, and I feel like you're protected. The, look, spirit is all around these people. Uh, your spirit guides are watching this happen. Like, I mean, they're watching it close. They're hearing everything that's being said about you. But I feel like your, um, your spirit guides are helping you to be happy and just keep your vibes high right now. Yeah, there's a karmic here who um, may have gotten pregnant just to have this masculine uh, provide for the situation, okay? So they're really only in it for money. It could have been someone else's baby, though. I'm seeing a lot of hot dogs in this picture. Yeah, they're going to see evidence. There's going to be some kind of evidence shown, either the looks of the baby, like this baby has has brown eyes and maybe this masculine look this masculine has blue eyes see um this is what i'm talking about and I, they're they're gonna be like well wait a minute uh this may not even be my kid they're gonna find some kind of evidence on this and i feel like that there this karmic situation is about to get rocked i'm telling you and this masculine, they're, they already know they're with the wrong person. They're feeling this heartbreak really bad. What I, I feel like they're, they're either seeing you out in public with somebody new, right? That's this. Or um, they heard about it through gossip. Yeah, look at how upset they are about that. They're like, I don't want to hear about anybody stepping towards my divine feminine i feel like you're you could be a divine feminine here i don't want anybody stepping towards the collective yeah wanting to put that work in or they know somebody else will this masculine is waking up they're angry they realize they don't want anyone else with you and that's making them realize how much in love with you they are because they are they're going crazy there's a karmic here who wants to possibly fight you as well. She's getting angry because I feel like y y there's something. I don't know what it is. She, yeah, they're wa they're both watching you. You do something on the computer, okay? Something um, on the internet. Sorry, they're watching you on computer. So you do something on the internet in the public eye, whatever you're talking about, or just the fact that. This masculine can't get you off of their mind. Or it's your glow up and your beauty, right? Because you're absolutely stunningly beautiful here. Great skin, great hair, looking good. This karmic is jealous of everything about you. Um, but you could also be exposing the fact that this baby isn't even this masculine's baby. You know, um, if you have a platform or... 
um, uh, some kind of podium, right? Um, you could have your own website. You could have some kind of ebook. You could have, you could just be on Twitter and Facebook. I don't know. Whatever you're putting out there, um, this karmic is really upset about it. Okay, the karmic is upset and angry. They want you out of the picture. They may even want to fight, physical fight, right? And this masculine is upset because uh, they're finding the truth out about everything, okay? Um, and they're realizing they're with the wrong person and you're detaching and moving on. Yeah, look at people are watching you close because you have hidden knowledge I feel like you're very spiritual. You could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with all of this water. That's all your intuition. Being divinely led here uh, with the, this is like the Six of Swords with your spirit team guiding you. I feel like you're exposing people maybe, you know. And this masculine is waking up. They're thinking what, there's got to be more to life than, than this. That is the meaning of this card. There's got to be more to life than this. I, I thought, wait a minute, I thought we had an in-ground pool. We only have a kiddie pool. I thought we had a mansion. The whole foundation is falling apart. It's a mess inside their home. Um, they're like looking around like, what the heck did I get myself into? Okay, they do not want to be there anymore. And meanwhile, you're out here enjoying a, like a lavish lifestyle. This is the difference between your person's life, your ex's life, and the life you've got going on. Okay, this is the difference visually. So their life is a wreck. Their emotions um, are a wreck. And I feel like this karmic situation is coming to an end. Meanwhile, you're peaceful, you're calm, you're receiving messages from the divine, possibly writing things down. You could be a writer, you could be journaling, possibly working on a creative project. Uh, you're definitely picking up on your intuition, what's going on behind the scenes, okay? You're, you're at peace, very meditative energy here. And your person, they're, they're finally waking up to their life, okay? And the shambles that it is. I mean, their, their life is a, is a mess. Okay, so what else can you show me? Ooh. I think that was a death card. Yeah, it's the end to that karmic situation, I'm telling you. It's the end. It's the, look, it's the grave is already dug, you guys, okay? Your person's name could be Doug, since I said that. They spend a lot of time in their car because they don't want to be at home. They don't want to be around the karmic because all the karmic does is fight about you, about you and get jealous and envious. I feel like they, I just saw the planning card and the pregnancy card, guys. I feel like this, this karmic is trying to trap your person in. Yeah, this is totally coming to an end. I'm telling you, that karmic situation is going to be over. Your person is waking up realizing everything this is like a sudden realization like you get look at same pose same look everything okay <laughs> they could be having some problems with their teeth they could be doing some drinking over this as well trying to numb um their pain and their misery and you're out here just I, you could be spending time at a pool. You could be on a vacation posting photos of yourself, you know. It could be anything. I'm telling you, this karmic is jealous of every little thing that you do, every little thing that they see about you. Okay, she's just jealous every day. Every day. Look, she's going crazy. Karmic. I'm telling you guys, she's going nutty. Um... 
Why is the karmic going so... Why is she so jealous? Why is this karmic so dang jealous? Because your person can't stop thinking about coming towards you with, a, with an offer because they can't stop thinking about how they're going to talk to you. Clarify this karmic. Because you're strong, because you act with integrity. She, this is, these are the reasons why she's jealous of you. Yeah, you're moving on because you're not paying attention to her or to the situation. You're being spiritually led. She's upset about your intuition as well. She's upset because you're getting all of these love offers. She's upset with your beauty, your strength. You could be a Leo. You could be a Cancer, Pisces, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, she's very upset about your intuition because you are like 10 steps ahead of this. That's what this is, too. You're walking in your truth and you're speaking the truth. That's the part she hates the most is that you're telling the truth and you're picking it all up with your intuition. You're ahead of her. You know, and like with everything that she's thinking and planning. And I feel like nothing has worked either. And anything, any bad energy she sent you, the, the, the swords are down. It's, it hasn't worked. Okay, you're still calm. You're still peaceful. You're beautiful. All right, very intuitive. She's jealous, jealous of you. And you're getting a lot of attention from others. I feel like she's jealous, too, because she may be broke. Look at how she's, I feel like there, she's hanging on to whatever money she can, very selfish, and yet giving you the finger, right? I feel like you're very abundant. She's jealous because this person can't stop watching you, and you're an empress energy, and she's not. Okay? She's watching you. They're both watching you like a hawk. She's jealous because the scales are being balanced for you. You're finally getting your wishes fulfilled here. You're finally getting love. Possibly, you know, love and support, right? Especially by the universe. Yeah, this, this uh, karmic is under judgment big time. I feel like there's really nothing she can do to stop all of this. Okay, and your person can't stop thinking about you either. This masculine wants to come towards you so bad. That's another thing that she's jealous about. And that the Wheel of Fortune is turning in your favor. But look, with the Five of Swords in reverse, this, this karmic can plan, plot, and strategize against you all day. And nothing is going to work. There's literally nothing they can do to stop your progress or stop your wish fulfillment and getting love. There's nothing that she can do. Look, and I feel like, yeah, I feel like there's a masculine here who's really upset because he knows he, uh, he walked away from an empress here. This is the empress in the minor arcana. You, you've transformed your life. You're extremely, extremely beautiful. You could be a Virgo. You could be a Scorpio, Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, and you're very abundant. You're growing, okay? Uh, your, um, your abundance is growing. Your, your business is taking off. You could have gotten a huge promotion. Like, your whole life is transformed. I feel like there's a masculine. There's no, nothing that this karmic can do to stop this masculine from walking away from the karmic and wanting to come towards you, okay? Your, your um, ex could be a, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, King of Wands energy, um, fuming, very jealous. They keep looking up here um, at you getting with somebody new. They're about to walk away from this karmic for you, okay? They're about to take some kind of action, they're angry, they're jealous, 
they're having an, they have an emotional breakdown when they find out that you are getting attention from someone else. Okay. Yeah, you've got other options. This is what they're upset about. That's what they're upset about, collective. So a lot of reasons why the karmic is jealous of you. One reason why your person is jealous of you. It's because you're getting love and attention from other people. Okay? Um, let's get your advice. What advice do you have for my beautiful collective? Advice for my collective. Yeah, I feel like their home situation is done. You know, and you're releasing this whole connection. You don't want to be a part of it anymore. You're ready. Um, ready to take a leap of faith into a new future. This is, um, be, this is starting a new life for yourself. Okay? What advice do you have for me for my beautiful collective? Advice for the collective. Yeah, and you're getting blessed. You release all of this karmic... Um, whatever this is, this, this situation that your person's in, you release this connection and you get blessed. So you're out here starting a new life and getting new, new. Okay, look at you. See, look. Sorry, collective. My battery died. Um, you, this is what you're getting, a new loyal heart. Okay? New people are starting to roll into your life now. All right, and I'm telling you, you're, you've either already met someone new or you're about to. Either way, when this masculine finds out, oh my gosh, they're going to, they're, it's literally going to send them into an emotional breakdown. Okay, for real. Like they lose it. They start crying. Oh, yeah, a higher power is possibly even leading you to a new location, a new community. I'm also feeling like there's a whole lot of gossip about you right now, wherever you are, right? In the community that you've been in with the, with the same old karmic people, they're all talking about you, okay? Give me one more. Oh, thank you. Yep, and it's stirring up a whole lot of chaos and conflict, but not for you. You're out here in a peaceful place right now, at, in peace, um, serenity, right? Uh, and you're out here enjoying your life, treating yourself, treating yourself well. Yeah, this masculine, I'm telling you, things are going to pop off. There's a lot of chaos and conflict in the background, but it's not touching you at all. I feel like you are divinely protected with the higher power out here. And so is this new connection. Okay, so just keep going by the book. Um, allow spirit to lead you and guide you, right? Um, just go with the flow. Trust your intuition. Trust the messages. Allow yourself to be led. Because I'm telling you, it's bringing you to all of this happiness, okay? Yes, okay?